My name is Alan. We're on Would You Buy That? And we're talking about magic water. Now, I have no idea what magic water is right now, so I'm about to introduce to you the inventor of magic water, Dr. Weiner, ladies and gentlemen. Dr. Weiner, how are you, sir? Good, good, good. Good. Thank you for having me. Thank you for being here. So tell us about magic water. You need water. Everybody needs water. I'm thirsty now. Well, I'm glad you said that, because I want you to try something. This is bottled water. Tell me what you think. That's some good water. It's good. It's, it's good. What if I give you that quality of water, but a third of the cost? Let me show you this. Are you ready? OK. That is magic water. My mind is blown right now, ladies and gentlemen. This man went into his sleeve and poured some water into this champagne glass. Hi. That's magic water. I want you to see this, how clear that is. It looks the same. Yeah, see if it tastes the same. I want you to do the same thing. Switch I'm it trusting around. you. I'm yeah. drinking this out of your coat pocket. You I'm trusting you. It's magic water. It's number one. It is, it is delicious water, ladies and gentlemen. This is absolutely good water. And it's cold for some apparent reason. Did we take out the metallic taste? That's absolutely, let's go. This tastes expensive, actually. America, three installments of $19.99, and you have unlimited supply of water. It's still cold. I'm clueless on how this works. I'm clueless on how he set up this water, but I'm excited about it. And we're about to find out right now the magic behind magic water. Let's do this. <laughs> so you urinate magic water. You urinate magic water. It's a filter somewhere. <clears throat> he urinated into this filter, and he, the filter cleans his urine, and it makes this magic water. And then you chill it, and then it tastes delicious as you tasted it. So that's urine that you have? Um, yes. That's magic water. Cheers. Let me give you some more. Hold on. Um, um, Dr. Weiner is here to answer the questions. And would we're, you buy that? Would you buy that? That's what we want. Alan. Hold on, man. You got. I know you didn't. I know your filter is broken. No, no. Dude, I, I, I will swing on this dude, and the filter is broken. What's going on? Live television, nothing like it. Are you all right? I'm cool. I just want to be clear. He's very hesitant. And I want to tell you, this is lemonade. This is lemonade. I use flavor crystals. I went back and I put in flavor crystals. Tastes like lemonade. It's lemonade. I'm telling you, you have a lemonade stand. You have kids that can't afford lemonade. You seem upset, buddy. Are you OK? Yeah, man. He, my man. So this segment is called celeb Brations. OK. So it's kind of a play on words. OK. Do you know what the two words are? Yes, celebrity and celebration. Great. And what we'll do is we'll have a celebrity name on here. On the screen, we'll pop up, read the information, and then I need for you to fill about a minute's worth of material. OK. We got breaking news! OK. Can we get Kent here? Is Kent coming or no? I called him. They're, they're in searching for him right now. All right, well, um, OK. I wouldn't ask you this, but I'm in a bit of a pinch right now. It's breaking news. OK. And we'll do a live interview. A live interview. So Julian from Florida. Five, four, three, two. Welcome back. We're going to take a break right now for some breaking news. And we have Julian from Florida. Yes, uh, uh, this is Julian James. Uh, what, what is going on? And what do you? Can, are, are the cameras picking that up? Um, we're picking what up? Um, what? Now, that was really bad. Julian. Julian. Did we lose he cannot. Um. Uh, Dave! We lost Florida! Nebraska. I think it's Liz. Liz from Nebraska. We are on the ground in Lincoln, Nebraska. We're talking to government officials. There's a mysterious noise coming from the clouds. A noise. It's like a woo! Woo! Oh my gosh. Wait, Liz. Okay. So Liz is in... Wait! Liz? Liz, Liz, wait. She's on right now. So, okay. So, Zuck Mark Zuckerberg, he is invested in advancing treadmill technology. Wow. I wonder what the... Hey, Nebraska! Nebraska! What is going on? Um, Kurt in California, let's okay, go! Okay, three, go. two, one! Hi, welcome back to Live News Network. I'm Natasha, I'm filling in for Kent. And now we have Kurt from California. 
A, an ominous bunch of craft have come over the area. It seems alien in nature. Did he say alien? It's, uh, it's definitely not natural. There's one right now. There's one. What, do you, what does it look like? We lost Europe. We oh lost oh Europe. God. Europe Day. Okay, keep talking, keep talking, uh, keep so talking. George Lucas. Star Wars. Who's a Star Wars fan? Whoa, 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 whoa. Confused. Oh my gosh. Shut the AC off. Shut the AC off. Um, so we are figuring out the fog situation. We will figure it out shortly. Uh, Would you mind taking off your blindfold? Sure. Hi. <laughs> oh my god, this is so romantic. Oh, I'm glad you love it. I'm Megan. Michael. Michael, yes. great to meet you. Likewise. <laughs> I'm definitely a dancer. You're a dancer? Yes, I'm a dancer. I love to dance. It's like my favorite thing. Just like this. Whoa. Yes, just like that. <laughs> that just like is that. a sexy walk. <laughs> yes, don't you like that? You love that, huh? I love that. It's perfect, right? Oh, you're so beautiful. You're so handsome. Uh, hi. Is this a date? Nice. Yeah, we're good. Thank you. I'm a ranger with the Pulsa Rosa Ranch, so. You guys haven't seen any snakes? No, Ooh. nothing at all. <laughs> I think it's time for us to continue our date. Can you let us do that, please? My bad. I'm just looking. Get out of here, sir. You're really starting to make me upset. Sorry, dude. Look out for creatures, then. Yeah, we'll right? be fine. Thank you. OK, God. Jackass. Oh, thank you. Uh, like, to be honest with you, that kind of aggression is pretty attractive to me. Really? You like yeah, that? Yeah, I like a guy who can, like, stick up for me and stick up for himself. Really? Yeah. What kind of guys do you normally are you attracted to? I feel like I only attract, like, animals. That's what you attract? Yeah. So, would you classify them as animals or monsters? I mean, I guess I would say that they're monsters, oh, yeah. Oh, they're monsters. Yeah. Like monster dates, huh? Yeah, they're monster dates. I mean... I'll be right back. I have to use the restroom real quick, OK? Oh, OK. Yeah. Awesome. Everyone okay? Whoa! Where is she? Dude, she came running. She said a crazy creature came in, like, flipped up the table. What? Wait, why are you dressed like that? I was gonna scare her, but... Wait, what? Holy Hey, where you at? Over here, hi. Sorry, I just got out of the pool. Wow. Hi. You're even cuter in person. Thank you. Hey, come on in and have a seat. Thank you. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get some dry clothes on. Mm -hmm. Try one of the massage chairs. They're really sure. comfy. I might be just a few minutes, OK? All right. No worries. All righty. Don't start without me. I won't. <laughs> <laughs> How's it going? Hi, hi. Just have a seat. Stay right there. What are you doing here? She wanted me to come see her. Who did? Kimmy. Kimmy 14? Yes. Do you know how old Kimmy is? No, I don't know. 14? 14. As the name would suggest. No. So, um, I was told she was 18. 18. And who told you that? Uh, my friend. And which friend is that? It's, well, <laughs> this is for a show. Um... Well, there's something you need to know. Okay. I'm Chris Hansen. Okay. And I have a show in which we catch predators, adult men, who come to homes to try to have sex with underage women. We've been setting up this house but... in a sort of a sting operation but... to see if men would come over and try to have sex with an underage girl. And here you are, you pop into our house. I'm not. A predator. Like, I'm, I'm an actor. I'm trying to make it. You're an actor who's in a bit of trouble right now, I must tell you. But, what, what is your name? Michael. But I'm not a predator. In your I'm... conversation online, you say, are you ripe for the picking? I'll be your daddy. This is not true. I'm not. Please sit down. I'd like to cover you in chocolate. We should make a Sunday out of our bodies. What's in the, what's in the backpack? They gave me this watch. They said there was a camera in it. A watch? What else is in the backpack? Um, they, they put condoms in Oh, here. they like, put condoms. Like, they gave me this bottle of vodka. So you expect me to believe that some TV it's producer truth, set you up, and then you send a picture of yourself bare-chested. That's you right there, right? Do you know that here in the United States, solicitation of a minor 
on the internet. But this, I'm telling you the truth. This is for a reality TV show. Well, listen, I've got news for you. Because you're getting another role. What kind of role? You are not going to be featured in a predator investigation. But you are going to be on a new show with David Spade called Fameless. What? What? Guys, come on in. Oh. These guys look familiar. Oh. 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 It's past burning. Okay. All right, I, I okay. Yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Just like All right, well, we're going to go through a commercial, and we'll come back and we'll tell you how we feel about this. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Right, go. Okay, we're out. Ten. Is he not coming back? All right, so you're Nine. just by yourself with Dr. Pockman. All right, then, uh, talk to him. All right, and we're back on Would You Buy That Network? where we are discussing this Brotox cosmetic treatment for men. And I've had it on for probably roughly four or five minutes. Nick had it on for a little bit longer. So uh, is, do I have to look forward to this right now? I can hear Nick yelling out there. Well, you look forward to the, the skin you have. Oh, I'm not looking forward to that. I will take my wrinkles. Is it the price that's the problem? I, I, that make no, a I, I would not do this for free. I am now deeply regretting that I tried it. I think there needs to be a warning or something like, hey, you're going to hurt. Fine, I will take some off. Especially since the towel you're using is now red from his blood. Okay, this was a Formula 6 problem. I, I think... Did you give us the wrong one? No, no, this is... It should be 7. Uh, but this is... Seven. That's his hair. It, it took off his hair. You're no, shredding off all, Nick's face all, and his hair. There's no hair. And, no, you just pocketed uh, the hair. There, there's blood. This, that's, uh, oh, is the, the towel that, come no, like that no, regularly? No, no, that's... That no, can, is, I, can I take that? Hold on, hold on. I now know I'm going to be scarred for life. Well, not, not for life. Is that just water? It's a solution. Okay, what, hold on it, one it, second. Yeah, what, no, what do you mean solution? Okay. Is it saline solution or? It's magic water, it's called. OK, there is no such thing as magic water. I'm not okay, from. Hold on, just. Um, oh my god. Is anything happening? You want me to see another area, maybe? It might not be as bad. Another area? <sighs> I am not happy. No, you're not getting it. You're not getting that I would have. All right, Nick is not happy. He is bleeding. Anger is one of the side effects. You're this getting... is an acid burn. Nick's face is red and scarred. It works, I'm telling you. This is <laughs> This is liquid acid. It's an exfoliant. You know what's an exfoliant? Pumice stone, sandpaper <laughs> that you can rub off. I don't want it. I'm not going to buy it. No one will buy this. You lost. Your well, hair is falling out. Is right. hair really that important? To me, yes, hair is very important. I feel like you're mad at me. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah. Okay, but it's worked. And right behind you, there's living proof. That's not, that's not living proof. Right behind you? Maybe in about three days. I hate everybody. <laughs> I hate everyone. <laughs> this product will not be available on this network, but it will be available on David Spade's prank show, Fameless. He's on my list. <laughs> He's on my list now. Nice. Hey, hey, I'm Dan. Sam. Sam. Dave. Dave. Welcome to Nature Bay. This is the show where we like to discover species previously unknown, OK? And you have an exciting opportunity today to maybe see a brand new creature that previously no one knew existed. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. I'm inside of the egg, and I just applied the pheromones to my hands. And we're waiting to see what's going to show up. I'm getting a huge heat signal, you guys. The thermals are off the charts. Something around 300 pounds. What? Oh, God! What? Stay in the air! No! Stay in the air! 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 Stay Oh, God. Stay in the air! 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 Stay in Stay down! Stay inside the egg, Sam. Sam, look at me! Oh my god. Stay, stay still. What is it? I don't know. It's a baby. Hey, animal, man. I don't know. What is that? Oh my god. Mayday! 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 Dang! Oh god! Oh god! Oh crap! Are you alright? Are you okay? Yes! But he okay. just tried to get inside! Stay right there! Okay. 
Okay, we're gonna get you out. Come on, man. I think we're in the middle of a hive. Come on, man, get out of there. Oh, you all right? Yeah. Okay. Stay right here. Back to back. Stay back. Stay back to back. All right. Man. You keep your eyes on the horizon there. I'm gonna keep my eyes here. Okay. Don't move. Did you say this way it went? I don't, I didn't see. Sam, listen to me. We're gonna stop. Nature bait is over, okay? It's done. We're done. Okay. All right? I don't want to do nature bait anymore. Okay. We're done with that. How about you? I, I don't either. Okay, I'm um, done. Which way do we go? Let's do something else. Okay. Let's do, let's do True TV's new prank show. What do you mean? It's, it's called Fameless. You're on it right now. <laughs> Are you all right, man? Are you serious? <laughs> yeah, man. Oh my God. Were you in on this? On what? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> uh, uh, you all right, buddy? Yeah, man. Whoa! Oh, did you 